Hey everybody, welcome back. It's Chewie again, and we're going to start right into uh, and some more industrial foregoing because I want to see, um, I want to start working with it, uh, enchantments uh, to basically pull off an add-on to different uh, weapons and armor. So, let's take a look at what we're going to make. Uh, the enchantment, enchantment extractor, the applicator sorter, and factory. So the sorter is going to be the first one here. Um, that was pretty easy. Uh, the factory. And the extractor. Oops. All right. So what I've done here is add uh, some power, um, and then I've got the essence coming off the ender tank from the triple green one, which is coming from this mob factory or mob crusher. I may have to add another one because I'm I had to stop the uh, wither skeleton um, because it wasn't able to keep up with the essence. So I'm going to probably have to make another mob crusher somewhere. I'm not sure where, but anyway. So let's go handle this that's the enchantment sorter oh, wow okay so the ones that are needing essence are starting to fill up so the extractor is nice because if you've got multiples on a uh, on a, on a book, right? So you've got fire protection, projectile protection. Those are all singles. I don't know if I've got any doubles or multiples on here. I think I may have just kept them. Yeah, that's, so that's got gloom and acquisition. Ghost Rider. All right. And so what we do with the extractor is you load it up full of books. And let it separate it into two separate enchantment books. All right, and that one's on its own. That one's on its own. So, um, applicator. Uh, if you want to start with, say, a straight diamond sword. All right, and you want to add smite to it, just like an anvil. But it uses the essence instead of XP. Nice trade-off. Um, also, you can take it from there to a book once this gets to a high, high enough level. Or we can do this from the From the extractor and it'll take it to the book all right so now i've got okay unbreaking reaper smite quick shot acquisition and gloom so another neither of those two i'm interested in uh i am interested in the quick shot i don't know whether it'll go to the um, draconic, but it would be nice. Oops. It does. Excellent. All right. So that should, oh yeah. That is much faster draw. Okay. So you can also hit this with, I believe on breaking. No, maybe not. Um, can we put Reaper on? Yes, there we go. That's a nice one. That's a nice addition. Um, unbreaking, Smite. Um, I think we already have that. Yeah, so uh, that's pretty nice. Oops, why do I have a... Oh. See, I moved that. I moved this for no reason. <laughs> I thought I was going to have an empty space there. There we go. 
Um, and we'll fill in behind here. Um, I wish I had done better here. That's kind of ugly. Although, actually, wait a minute. That doesn't need to be there. They all will get power from underneath. So, that did work out for me. Now, uh, what's nice is when you get to, once you get to a certain level, um, the applicator will just give you a random, uh, a random enchant. So we can wait till that shows up. I think it's three quarters to a, a, a full tank of essence. Um, so like I said, this stuff, this stuff takes a lot of essence and you're, you're already seeing that it's gone through pretty much everything. Um, so this one has a full tank, but it's, you know, I set the, uh, enter tank. I don't know if I can get, to, yeah, I can do it here. So I set the filter to distribution round robin. So this, I would have thought this would have been an even split between them. So they would have stayed the same, but apparently not. So it filled this one first pretty much. And then left this one, you know, twist in there. So, um, can I do, yeah, I think I can. Yep. There we go. That's what I should do. Cleaner. Nicer. Still works. Okay. So I'll come back to that in a second. Um, so where do I want to put another room? So I got, these are seven by sevens. Um, I don't think I have enough here at the front to do it. Um, especially with this front lip here, because in order to hit that seven by seven, it needs to be outside. Um, let's see, one, two, three, four. I don't necessarily mind it in that corner. I don't know if I've got seven. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we're going this deep. That looks like it'll work. Two, three, four. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Nice. Okay, and so now we'll start with tinted glass. And then we'll want a uh, full Outside, but we want dirt in the middle. Because this will be turned to uh, cursed dirt, or I forget what it's, I forget what it's called. Dreadful dirt. That's it. Uh, so we're still waiting there. All right. Um, So, let's get these dug out on the side. Hmm. 
Hmm. There we go. So now, oops. So we don't want any light levels in here that we don't need to necessarily have. And so hopefully, because I didn't do this on the other ones, uh, I'm hoping that uh, I actually don't need to go up as high as seven, but it's just easier because it's um, two levels up and my reach is five. So, and the, the other one is seven anyway. <laughs> so it just kind of makes sense. So that can go and get moved around. Um, where should I put this? Right there. So now we should be able to go around the edges here. All right, so let's break ourselves a little hole here. Wand. Hopefully this works this time. Yep. Oh, jeez. Well, I mean, what if I didn't have torches in my offhand? And, and that's my fault. That's just a keybind I missed. But anyway. Some. Okay. Wow. There we go. Now we're completely dark. Nope, we're not. <laughs> I missed one somewhere. There. All right, so. again and we basically just need to get this dirt solid um, I did not think about the fact that I already had this latex set up over here and all of my stuff uh, is gonna be there so I am going to have to dig out a little bit All right, so we want our mob crusher. To go here. Perfect. We want Just 
just to make this a little cleaner. Oops. Got to configure it. <laughs> All right. So we're going to pull from the sphere. Perfect. Now we need a, a range add on. So I'm grab another three. All right. And so we need what do we need? Uh, Ender tank. Fluid pipes and also item pipes, and we need an ender chest. All right, so I think all green. Yes. All right. So we are almost set. Just need to turn that off. And I need to find another chicken. And hopefully I can find one soon instead of spending all this time looking around for a chicken. It's not looking like it. All right, so I'll be back when I find a chicken. All right, here we go. There we are. Okay, so. I need that. I think we're all set in here. All right, so we'll add a speed upgrade as well. Okay, um, that is now producing essence also. Now, um, I do want to keep this as dark as possible. Oops. There we go. So that should keep things dark. Um, oh, so the enchantment applicator is only going to work on a. Okay, so it worked on an item. So whatever we want to look for. So you wanted a bow. You put a bow in.
do I have to have I have to have the book first huh I did not realize that so this requires a book and an item and it'll still use essence though instead of your own XP okay yeah kind of makes sense uh, enchantment factory I think this is the one yep so this will just put on a random enchant on the book all right and so you're usually going to get multiples on this one so this is where the extractor comes in handy um, books there we go so that's already full up again so knockback and loyalty four I don't have any tridents yet so but that's a good but now that we have it it's good because we can actually kind of tailor what we need um, Supreme Hole Tank. I, oh yeah, I wanted to put this. So. Once this is empty. Then I'll put it in its place. from a firm position there we go all right and that's good all right so we're 24,000 buckets out of a 2 billion yeah so that's a max int uh, supreme black, black hole so that's maximum integer size um, this is keeping up okay yeah, I think that's good for now. Um, in my, I'm working on this. I'm going to show this, but it's not working. So I have a lava room here set, um, but I'm trying to figure out what's hap actually happening. The uh, magmatic dynamos are actually filling with lava and output, but they are not actually pushing anything to the sphere. So only 1,000... FE a tick, which should be much, much higher than that. Uh, these, oops, uh, these energy cables are, are capable of much higher than that. I'm not exactly sure, but especially when they all have uh, ultimate upgrades. But anyways, that's what, that's the future plan for all the lava. So, um, I want to say we're right at about where I wanted to finish this off. So I think... I'm actually going to call this and look at the next set of ideas for what to look at next. I, mean, I may be, I may actually start to try and build something. I am not a builder, <laughs> but uh, I may try and figure something out with this. This uh, I like this utilitarian or um, utility area, uh, but it's not really much of a house or a home or anything like that. So I will try and figure something else out or we may just go to another mod <laughs> that too so anyways thanks for watching hopefully this was entertaining uh if you like the video and you want to see more hit the subscribe button and if you would like to be reminded of them uh, when i upload a new video hit the bell and sign up for notifications thanks for watching